Hello, my amazing sexy mofos. This is your boy Venomy here. I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. In today's video, I am back with another Fallout 76 video. Today is something different and special for every single one of you. How to obtain every single rare baseball bat. Now, there's three colors we're going to be focusing on the most that's yellow, pink, and indigo. But before we start, if you are new around here and like what you see, then please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But now let's jump. Okay, in the video I will have two routes that you can do as well just to maximize your chances of obtaining one of these. And for now I'm just going to show you every single other color. Now to wrap the confusion up, natural all the way to red, they're common. And then you've got mahogany and all star. I believe oak is also common, but all star and mahogany are rarer than the others. I'd say they're uncommon, but they're not rares. The three actual rares are uncraftable. You can only find them. You have a three percent chance at getting them, and that is pink, yellow, and indigo. Right now on your screen, right now, that is a yellow one. It has like a, a weird little tinge to it. It's not just yellow, if you know what I mean. It's yellow and a little bit of a mix of another color. It looks scraped up a little bit. It's like the metals are showing a little bit slightly under the yellow. Now I'm just going to be showing you the indigo and the pink as well. Now I'm collecting loads of these and giving them away as I understand quite a lot of people don't have them. OGs and old players, they do have loads of them. But uh, quite a lot of new players have no uh, idea or understanding of these whatsoever. But these are super, super goddamn rare. There's barely anything about it on YouTube. So I'm just going to be going in depth about the route as well. Now, just let you really quickly have a look at the pink one. Looks beautiful. Now, when it comes to the route, there's two spots that you can predominantly hit if you want to be server hopping going into a public world and then into a private world now you can go to the foundation which is a free fast travel point all the way to white springs which is a free fast travel point and just check those two go into a private check them and then go back into a public and server hop like that or you can follow this route start at rng station go to foundation then go to white springs then check the White Springs Golf Club, then Pleasant Valley, as well as Pleasant Valley Station. Then if you go up a little bit more to the left in Morgantown, you've got two to three in Morgantown. You've got a bar that are mark with a marker, and you've got Morgantown High School. High School, you've got three baseball bat spawns in there. Where my marker is, is a bar. There is also a baseball bat spawn in there. In Grafton, you've also got a couple of spawns up there, but I predominantly only go to two. That is the Vendor Bot, and there's the Radiation Shed. Um, I will say this really quickly though, any Raider Bot has a chance at spawning colored baseball bats. So, to maximize your chances, you could either go for the really long run, going from RNG Station, going all the way to Foundation, then White Springs, then Pleasant Valley, then Morgantown, then Grafton. So you're hitting up multiple, multiple spots. Then you'd go to a private world, do the same. You are going to be burning through some caps. I'm not going to lie doing it that way. You are going to be burning through quite a few, but you are maximizing your chances of actually getting one. Or if you wanted to be able to fast travel for free and just rapidly check servers, you're only going to be having two chances by doing it this way, but you're rapidly going through the servers, so you're maximizing your chance. You'll be checking a public, you'll be checking a private, quick 30 seconds, then you'll be server hopping again, quickly check everything, quick 30 seconds, you'll be hopping again. For that way, that's just hopping Foundation and White Springs because they're both free fast travel points so you can just fast travel between both of them for free. The uh, Black Powder Vendor Bot inside White Springs. 
he's the robot that will sell colored baseball bats. If you were watching the video, you would have saw me in the beginning buy the baseball bat, the pink one, for 80 caps, which is an absolute steal. The yellow one and the indigo I acquired off one of my friends who is Jug. He is absolutely amazing. Massive, massive shout out to him. This, this video would not be possible without him, to be fair, because he just out of nowhere he had what I needed and I, I couldn't think him any other way so a massive shout out to Jug he is absolutely amazing he does escape rooms on Fallout and everything he is such a cool guy definitely have to I'll put his gamer tag down below and definitely hit him up he is a lovely guy maybe you can go through one of his escape rooms and um, just have a little bit of a different taste of the wasteland but before I wrap up on this video, I just want to quickly say the chances of finding these bats and the percentages. Like I'm not going to lie, I'm going to be honest with you. You are going to have to serve a hop a little bit. You might get lucky first try. It has happened before. Some people have had to serve a hop quite a few times between private world and then public. You can serve a hop just public back out, wait a couple of seconds, hit public again rinse and repeat and you can serve a hot public and just jump in different LFG groups looking for friend groups on Xbox or just joining a different recent player or a different friend in a different session there's loads of different ways to serve a hop and just obviously increase your chances of possibly getting one of these colored baseball bats when in talking percentage you have a 27% chance to get a natural 12 for a cedar, oak or mahogany 6% chance for black, blue, grey or red and you've got a 3% chance, it's arguable, some people say it's 2, I say it's 3, we got a 3% chance for an all star, an indigo, pink or yellow. Now I know those percentages don't sound great but those percentages are significantly higher than for example the red asylum dress for example which i believe is 0.02 i believe which is extraordinarily rare some some people have been playing for over three four five years and have never even come across one so it's not that that rare you will find one eventually i absolutely promise you and i've got loads of them at the moment so i will be giving away quite a few of them just to lucky subscribers, uh, I was thinking of maybe a big giveaway for those type of baseball bats. Um, I don't know how to plan that type of giveaway yet, but maybe I don't know. Like, we'll, when I reach a different YouTube milestone, I'll definitely bundle those three: the yellow, the blue, indigo, and the pink. Just to someone extraordinarily lucky, or I could pair them off like individually: the three rare baseball bats to three lucky people. Or I could just give one person the, the set of them. It's, I'm not too sure how to really work it yet, but I'm going to let you all enjoy the rest of the footage. All these vendor bots I'm going to are raider bots. Just remember, any raider bot has a chance at giving you these colored baseball bats. You need to remember that. After you've checked every single raider bot, every single location, just simply back out rinse and repeat don't give up i know it can get repetitive but keep keep at it keep trying and i promise you you'll get it but i'm gonna wrap this video up here i really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far but i love every single one of you and i'll see you all in the next video